The Forsyth County Board of Commissioners recently approved almost $10 million for the construction of two new corporate hangars at Smith Reynolds Airport. We're going to be demolishing some old buildings here at Smith Reynolds Airport. Uh, we're going to be tearing down an old hangar and then a building on the corner um, and we're going to build two 20,000 square foot corporate hangars. So we're going to have a, a corporate hangar right here at this spot. It's going to be moved back a little bit to make sure there's no obstructions to the uh, when you're taking off and landing from the airport. And uh, so one will be about right here and then the other one more down towards the corner. And so we have uh, tenants that have been waiting. We're 100% full on hangars. So this is a uh, great project. How many airplanes are we talking about storing in these hangars? It depends on the size of the aircraft. So if it's small single engine aircraft, we can get you know several, uh, you know, 15 or so in there. But if they're large uh, Gulf Streams or something like that, you might get three or four. So it depends on the size of the aircraft. But these hangars are gonna have higher door heights and uh, larger span doors uh, so we can get the largest corporate uh, aircraft in here. The new hangars are part of bigger plans for Smith Reynolds Airport. Corporate aviation is a, a big market for us and we need to accommodate those those passengers and those uh, users. And so uh, that just fits right into our role. Plus we're looking at the future of flight and so we're also considering some other alternatives uh, to maybe accept some of those, uh, what they call uh, EVATOLs, electric vertical takeoff um, kind of craft as well as other larger, um, maybe even unmanned aircraft that need runways, those kind, not the smaller ones, uh, but uh, we just uh, very excited about the future. I'm Wesley Young, reporting for the Winston-Salem Journal.